Tadpole Treble, an adorably charming adventure. In Tadpole Treble, you play as a tadpole that swims too far from her mother and gets separated when a pelican sweeps her up and you spend the rest of the game trying to swim back to your pond. This is a rhythm-based game, or anti-rhythm-based game, as the beat is actually your enemy here, which I honestly think kind of hurts the game a little bit. Don't get me wrong, the notes being the obstacle is fine, but some spots in these levels your character will follow the beat for points, food, and bubbles, opposed to avoiding it, and these brief moments are shown to be much more satisfying than the dodging moments. These moments bring the charming music to life, and I would have loved to see more of this style like the Thunder Creek level which is easily my favorite in the game, and I'm sure this moving to the beat instead of against it is why this is so, as I feel like dodging turns this wonderful soundtrack into background noise. As again, the game is basically training you to drown it out and avoid it. There are 12 levels in the main story as well as a secret level that can be unlocked by completing challenges, and each level has its own unique feel to prevent the game from ever feeling like a drag, which is great as the game encourages multiple playthroughs for unlockables and to chase high scores. I played through the game twice, my first time taking 2 hours and my second time taking 50 minutes, and I still wasn't bored with this game. These levels can be quite challenging, as again you're going against notes instead of with them, and every level has its own unique obstacle to it, like toxic water slowly draining your health, piranhas chasing you, or going backwards through rapids. You'll die plenty of times during your initial playthrough. The game is swift and super satisfying find when you can pull off dodging and collecting everything thrown at you. You can also create your own levels here with tons of musical options. Unfortunately though, these created levels are more about the music than they are level design, as your enemy and obstacle type is very limited here. All in all, Temple Trouble is an enjoyable time with a great soundtrack guaranteed to get stuck in your head. I just wish there was more focus on sucking you into these songs. I give Temple Trouble a 7.5 out of 10. If you played Tap World Trouble, tell me what you thought about it down in the comment section below. If you haven't played it, tell me if you plan on picking it up. Thumbs up. If you like the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And tune in Monday for first impressions where we find out what game we're playing next. Thanks for watching.